I told him how busy I am. He knows. He knows my plate is full. He just doesn't care. I am an attending with an entire service of my own. Herman and I have shared dozens of patients before. Oh, and now he's just bringing this guy to my lab, right? Like, I'm going to say no to a guy who gave up his leg for our country. She has me <laughs> reviewing journals and doing skills labs. I have a case report that's due by four. I'm sorry, excuse me. I have a neuroblastoma to remove it for. <laughs> Wait. Is this your way of telling me that you're canceling our meeting with the surrogacy agency tonight? What? No, wait, no. I will, I will figure that out. <laughs> I just, say something to help me. You own a hospital. You are raising a beautiful girl. You save babies. You're gonna save more, right? You can do this too. If anyone can, you can. Oh, oh okay. Um, listen, I will meet you at the agency with a smile on my face. <laughs> and we will get ourselves a new baby. <laughs> ABC's mm -hmm. It's 100% titanium body and 13 sensors. But before we can get you in a leg like this, we need your muscles and nerves to interface with the sensors. So this electromyogram will show spikes when your muscles contract and then go flat when they rest, okay? All right, go ahead and flex for me, Jeff. This is done, I get to keep it. Well, it's all funded, including follow-up, so yes. <laughs> Sorry, I know how that sounds. It's just all I wanted was to be a ranger, you know? I still dream about it all the time. Pack on my back, run in my team, and I wake up and get out of bed. I try to stand, and I forget about it. So you know, when you say free robot leg, I think I'm still dreaming of running with the guys. Jeff, are you still flexing? Yeah. You can take a picture of it? Yeah. My mom, <laughs> she's gonna freak. Jeff, flex harder for me. What? I should be seeing readings. What, what's going on? Uh, we're, we're just having trouble with the EMG. No, no, <laughs> it's not the EMG. Jeff, I'm- Dr. Torres, can I talk to you for a moment? Excuse us, Jeff. That was inappropriate. Inappropriate? You were yeah. about to reject him from the study. Yes, you saw those readings? Look, the way his amputation was performed, there's no way this will work. Okay, it's a crappy amputation. Yeah, probably because it was done in less than ideal circumstances. He is a soldier, Cal. I know that. Yeah. I feel bad about that, all right? I, I care about that. I really do. You know who doesn't care? You know who doesn't give a damn about his service? The robot leg. All the robot leg cares about is that the nerves in his leg aren't communicating with his muscles, which means they can't communicate with the sensors in the prosthesis, which means the robot leg won't work. And you can find a way to help him. Just, just figure it out. I'm sorry, are you not listening to me, Owen? Are you deliberately being obtuse? I just told you his nerves. Just fix it, just get back I in I just there. told you I can't! Fix it, that is an order. Oh, an order? <laughs> Who are you, General Patton? I'm your chief of surgery. On the surgical floor, you are my chief. In my lab, funded by the money that I procured, I am in charge. Oh, are we clear? No, you don't get these guys' hopes up and then leave them with nothing. No, 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 I didn't do that, Owen. You did that. You're the one out there running your mouth at the rehab center uh, about free, pain-free, $6 million man robot legs. I'm about to go in there and crush his dreams because of you. 